Hello everyone, this is David from goldstartool.com and today we're gonna review, review the um, trimming machine, a trimming machine. Um, a lot of people now these days, there are these sewing machines that come with all these fancy schmancy trimming, auto lift, uh, fully computerized uh, stuff and um, People like it because a lot of people like this machine because at the end it cuts and trims the thread and it makes it beautiful, nice, very nice finish. So a lot of factories where they have a bunch of sewing machines and they don't really want to change that to a new um, um, to a new system, new sewing machine with all the trimming stuff, make it more expensive. There are trimming machines that you could use in your finishing line when you garment whatever you're making product is done finished and is leaving the door at the end you could get rid of these lint you see what i'm talking about when you're checking at the finished line the garment make sure the garment is good now it could be anything any type of sewing right uh, there are this um trimming machine that you could have it on the side and while you're pushing everything out the door the guy, the person, the um, the whoever is checking that stuff could just go ahead and check and make sure that there is no lint whatsoever hanging uh, at, on the garment. So what we're we gonna do? This is a uh, called. I just wanna make sure I'm saying it right. Techmatic trimmer T sixteen three four five zero. It's on our website. It used to be very, very popular, very, very popular. But now these days you have more machines that they have only trimming systems. But I know not everybody uses um, a trimming system, especially on, let's say, very, very heavy stuff. Let's say when you're doing a lot of heavy stuff like this, a lot of people don't have trimming on their machine. So we want to use the trimming machine. Now, uh, when you open the box, this is what you're gonna have. Very simple, you have, this bucket right here. This goes on the bucket, you're done. Okay, there is a red hose. Okay, you have two, what do we call it, fasteners? Yes. One goes on here, you could open it up. By the way, you need a couple of um, a screwdriver. Uh, here we go, I have them with me, make sure. Uh, you can come closer if you want. Um, so one goes to this end, right, and one goes to the trimming machine. Now, this trimming machine, I'm going to show you, it's like the same shavers. The wall shavers that you have, you see, it said Techmatic, the same way that you shave, or you, you go to these pet grooming places, it's the same thing one of the other end goes here right this is the uh, the uh, the tube that holds the uh, trimming machine and this end that you have here goes to the motor and the motor i'm going to open this up nicely go on the top here that are very very simple so you have three major units one here which you just open this up and put this on top you don't have to do nothing okay when you receive this don't be surprised a bunch of newspaper inside okay hold inside and then the, you tie it with the fasteners and then you the other end of the hole goes to the trimming Right here, you put this uh, bracket inside the, the pole inside the stand, right here. And this sits, whoop, this sits right here. And you just tie all the screws. Now, the other end of this, just to make it very, this one goes here, you see the screw? opens up goes here 
and this one goes right in here very simple now you see this one has a uh, what do you call this a notch mm -hmm. and when you put in there and turn it around you see that it goes right in here you see that screw here the notch in there you just press it in there now i might have to open it up and i will do that if you want just put everything on pause so we could go ahead and just put everything together because we don't have to waste people's time so it didn't take me more than honestly one minute the fasteners here or that here and uh, we put the fastener here do the hose here i tied this screw two seconds there's a screw here that you tie and there's a screw here that you tie for this one now i'm going to put this one this is the most tricky part it's not a big deal it's just that it's because this thing it turns all the time you want to make sure that when this goes in like this on one two three tie this up and you are good to go one more thing that i didn't show you is the owner's manual and it's in english and it tells you exactly what you have to do and how to service how to clean what to do the cleaning of the blade whatever it needs to be done it's in here it's a very very handy uh, template or owner's manual that you could have and it also teaches you or shows you how to put everything together uh, I'm gonna plug this in. It's going into a 110 volt. Any type of factory, garage, any place. Um, this one goes to the electricity. And then, because we don't want you to, um, maybe a lot of people don't have a lot of outlet. You, this one, goes in here. Right? Now, there one more. These are if you want to have multi stations for your thing. All right. So there is a, uh, where is the on and off switch? You see? On and off switch right here. Here. You turn it on. This is a vacuum. Suction vacuum takes all the trimming inside. And this one right here, it will uh, trim, right? Now, here you could also, the vacuum could be high, low. I'm gonna do it. The way you do it, very, very simple. Let me start with this one, right here. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay? See that one? You take it, you can come here now. You take it, and you, see, right? Then you take it, done, right? Let's do, I'm gonna do some very heavy, like thread. You see this one? Go. That's how you do it. That's how it's done. Any type of thing? Are you filming it? Yes. Good. See? Done. It's very, very easy, very simple. Uh, all you have to do, make sure this is, I'm going to shut this down, you're going to make sure that when this is full, clean it up. There is a filter right here, you see this filter? All you have to do, take it out, either you could wash it or spray it with air and clean it up and put it back in there and clean it inside. There is nothing else you have to do very simple very easy to work with a lot of people these days are looking for a way to do things faster make sure everything you know is clean before you ship it out you could have for every four or five machines or even two machines or three machines you could have one of these stations very good we have it on our website it's 115 volt take matic go to our website 
check it out a great great piece of um, tool that you could have for your factory for your home sewing for quilting shop for your tailoring shop it's just amazing now that these days that everybody's making all this mass or um what do you call those garment the garment the medical garments the scrubs and, yes scrubs and whatever you make and you want to do it fast one two three this is the uh, machine to do everything thank you for watching this is david from goldstartool.com uh, please like share um, what else they have to do subscribe subscribe and have a golden day have a golden day thank you for watching